Hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode of... What's it called again? Wait, what did you say? What? Oh yeah, right, Back to the Future. So, um, let's ask this question. What were you hiding when I came in just now? Hiding? I don't know what you're talking about, son. Come on, I saw it. It was a videotape, right? Um... I might as well tell you. After all, you'll be 18 soon. Tell me what? Hill Valley under Citizen Brown is not quite the contented town you were led to believe it was. Uh. No way. This isn't a criticism of the great man himself, of course, or his sainted wife, Edna. No one's worked harder than they to apply the most advanced social planning techniques to our municipality, but... What? Confidentially? Not everybody appreciates it. A great many citizens, perhaps even the majority, actively resent the Brown administration. They don't say so publicly, of course. But in private? Well, just listen. I tell you, Bert, this regime is a joke. They're all laughing at us over in Fairfax. A toast to Citizen Brown. May his beloved courthouse be struck by lightning. Shh, Agnes, you're awful. Are you coming to the town square, Lester? Citizen Brown's about to give another speech. Citizen Brown can kiss my hairy... Well, you get the idea. Uh, it sounds like people can't stand what the Browns have done to Hill Valley. Not everyone. Only around 50%, maybe 60. Does Citizen Brown know? He should. Whenever I send copies of my raw footage to the public relations department over at the courthouse, I get a memo telling me how much Citizen Brown thanks me for my service. But how could he see those videos and not do anything about it? Maybe you should take your tapes directly to Brown. Oh, I don't know about that. I mean, sure, he might appreciate my bringing these problems to his attention and reward me for my public service, but then again, they say it's never wise to be the bearer of bad news. Uh. Why don't you give me those videotapes? I'll take them to Citizen Brown. Thanks for offering, son, but I don't want to get you involved. Citizen Brown won't like what he sees on them, and I wouldn't want you to get the brunt of his displeasure. Not to mention the displeasure of all the folks on the tapes. Once they find out I recorded them... No, I'm not letting these tapes out of my sight. It's too dangerous. It's about Mom. She's thinking about signing up for the Citizen Plus program. Is she now? You're not gonna let her go through with it, are you? Well... From what I hear, it's a fairly drastic procedure which completely reshapes the subject's personality. On the other hand, if Citizen Brown recommends it, it's gotta be a good thing. Yeah. Hmm. Something on your mind? What's the deal with the house, Dad? I don't know how to tell you this, son, but while you were away at your math and magic competition, our house got slapped with a CZ-36 violation. What? I know, it's so embarrassing. Your mother's mortified. She works so hard to keep a clean house, but those dust mites are so hard to keep down. Wait a minute, we can't go into the house because of dust mites? Well, not until they send in the cleanup crew. This is ridiculous. Thank goodness they let me move my office out here into the garage. Mm, I really hate this Hill Valley. I wonder what the rest of America thinks, because, like, surely this is, like, slavery, kind of. Um, like, shouldn't the US government send in troops or something to kill Sisson Brown? And Edna, mostly. You'll find out why. How exactly does this setup work? I'm glad to see you taking an interest. Each of these monitors is connected to multiple cameras, of which I've strategically jacked into throughout the valley, with official clearance, of course. I can switch between cameras with these buttons. There's also a VCR for each monitor. I keep a record of everything I see. So, if I happen across something intriguing, I can keep it on file. Well, I'll leave you to your snooping. Supervising, son. Supervising. I'll leave you to it. Right. Snooping. Hey, hey what for? Insufficiently polished shoes. Good day, citizen. Uh, let's go back to the town square. Uh, 
Uh, and Lorraine. She looks like she's on drugs, really. Oh, it might be just me. Mom? Uh, Mom, are you uh, drinking again? Don't be silly, dear. Booze is illegal, you know. Yeah, Mom. It's just that Dad mentioned. Your father. Why, I just can't get away from his prying eyes. Always spying, always watching. You, you mind your own business, George. Now, Lorraine, this is for your own good. I know you're keeping a secret from me. It's mine to keep. <laughs> Dad, Mom, knock it off, you two. Now, you listen here, young man. This is an adult matter between your mother and me. Dad, I know, but your way isn't working. You gotta give her some space here. Huh? Where'd she go? Mom? Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it. What is that in your hand? Rum? Gin? A wine cooler? For your information, it's brass cleaner. I have a job to do here, you know. Lorraine? No. Lorraine, I'm just trying to look out for you. You know the kind of trouble we can get into if you're mean. drinking again. Yeah, it is this. George, I wouldn't be Why so on edge if you weren't suffocating me all the time. Was that in it? Carry on. Ah, uh, what happened? What the heck am I looking at? Yes. Okay, where's the rain? I can't go there. This is really weird. Mom, now the dad isn't watching. Oh, Martin. Uh, <clears throat> Was that a flask, Mom? Flask? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I, I. Look, it's okay, Mom. Get a hold of yourself. Oh, your father's right. I'm backsliding. But it's been so hard, what with your brother and sister leaving, and then your father getting obsessed with his monitors and draw. <laughs> Let me take care of the flask. Dad doesn't have to know anything about it. <laughs> doesn't look sad at all. Oh, thank you, sweetheart. I couldn't bear the thought of facing your father over this. This timeline sucks. Mom and Dad are fighting again. Mom's drinking. It's like everything Doc and I ever did to fix things is falling apart. Time to get some attention. Yeah, no kidding. Where's Parker? Hands up, citizen. Assume the position. Here goes nothing. There better be apple juice in this. Uh, why don't you open it and find out? Don't get smart with me! Uh, I knew you were no good, McFly. Officer Parker, what seems to be the problem here? Citizen McFly, ma'am. Came strolling up with a 181B violation in his pocket. Ugh. You, young citizen, where did you get that? I that wish I could break neck. booze. Nowhere? Is he being smart with me? Yeah, he played that attitude on me as well. Could we just fast forward the lecture and just get this over with already? No! Officer, demerit him severely. And as for the alcohol, drop it into the decycling bin. With pleasure, ma'am. No. Keep your nose clean, or you'll find yourself in front of Citizen Brown. That's the point. Uh, do I have enough time to make friends with the stray dog? Oh, it's not really stray, but yeah, sure, I, I do have enough time. Okay, okay. 
Welcome to Soupmo, where soup is just... Oh, it's you. This better be important, McFly. Leech, was that Jennifer? Well, A, it's none of your business, and B, seeing as she ain't your chick no more? Yeah. Okay, now this timeline is really pissing me off. Me too. You and Jennifer? Really? Oh, is the poor little nerd jealous? Well, yeah, and a little disgusted. That's probably the soup. You got a cold or something? Ugh, it's allergies. I swear, there's a dog hanging out around here somewhere. A dog? Yeah, and the stupid mutt keeps trying to steal my free samples. What's on the menu? Soup. Just soup? And more. What falls under the more category? We got neat loaf. It's made with textured wheat protein. Uh, no thanks. What kind of soup you got? Uh, scrolle... Rivellini? Yeah, that's right. Some things never change. What else falls under the more category? Well, there's the hum burger. It's made from pressed roasted hummus. Do you have any real meat back there? Define real. I'm afraid to ask, but what other non-soup food do you have? Anything edible? Well, we have these pea and liver with soy cheese hot dogs. They're new, and we're offering free samples. You want one? Where are the free samples? Here. I keep them behind the counter. Oh, God. If you puke, you're cleaning it up, wuss. I, I can't finish this. Not my problem. Uh, let's go. See ya. Smell you later. So, dog. Hey, hey! There's that mangy. Ah, go get him, McFly. Is it possible to die from sneezing? Can you imagine that? Death by sneezing. I need that can, but... Oh. Apparently all we need to do was that. Um, I'll, I'll just do this like right now, so I don't have to do it later. It would look better blue. No, it won't. Not the way you colour it. He's got to be hiding in here somewhere. So you can never guess where he is unless you paint the plank. Stay put now, boy. Wherever you are. He actually will not, not guess. Not a sign of him. Uh, the chant, the, the randomizer of where he is will is only chain is only activated um once you press on one of the three options okay let's go now Can you be any slower, McFly? Now we're in business. I outsmarted you, didn't I? Oh, don't be like that, Einy. And get him this disgusting thing. Look, Einy, I've got a treat for you. Atta boy. Now hold still. See, I'm not such a bad guy, right? <laughs> whoa, whoa, okay. I guess I've won you over. I wish they were all this easy. Yeah, me too. Huh? Well, what is it, boy? <laughs> Einstein, wait! No! 
Can you kill her already, please? Oh, rabies! Rabies, help! Back! Down! Sit! Play dead! Uh, Officer Parker, subdue that beast at once! Einstein, sit! Einstein? Oh, if he bites me, you'll be in a world of trouble, citizen! Wait, I know that creature. Officer Parker, that's the stray that keeps escaping the kennel. I thought he was muzzled. I took the muzzle off. You what? That's right, he's my dog now. Citizen, you are in violation of Statute 357K. Parker, demerit this hooligan at once. I'll return this creature to the kennel. Yes, ma'am. Still wants to break the neck. Wretched beast. Don't worry, Aini. Once I fix all this, you'll be back with Doc and romping through time. Now stay out of trouble. Unless you want a visit from Citizen Brown. Maybe I do. Bitch. Okay, uh. Well. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.